How many types of sprinklers are used in fire protection and firefighting systems? First, we have conventional sprinklers. These come in three different styles, pendant, which hang down from the ceiling, upright, that stand vertically at the top of the pipe, and sidewall, which are mounted on the side of a beam or wall. Next up, we have quick response sprinklers. The clue is in the name. These are designed to activate more rapidly, helping control or suppress a fire faster. Then we have extended coverage sprinklers. These are designed to cover larger areas than standard sprinklers, making them ideal for expansive spaces. Dry pipe sprinklers are our next type. These are used in areas where the pipes might freeze, with the pipes filled with pressurized air and water released only when the sprinkler is activated. Preaction sprinklers are similar to dry pipe systems but require two steps to operate. The sprinkler head must first open and then water is released when a fire detection system confirms the presence of a fire. Deluge sprinklers are another unique type. All sprinklers connected to the system simultaneously release water when a fire is detected. These are often used in high hazard areas. Next, we have foam sprinklers. These are designed to discharge a mixture of water and foam concentrate for specific fire hazards, such as flammable liquids. High pressure sprinklers, designed to operate at higher pressures, are suitable for environments where standard pressure may not be sufficient. Then there are residential sprinklers. These are specifically designed for use in homes, with a more aesthetically pleasing appearance compared to commercial sprinklers. AESFR or Early Suppression Fast Response sprinklers are designed for use in high-piled storage or other areas where a fast response is critical. And finally, we have corrosion-resistant sprinklers. These are made from materials that resist corrosion, making them suitable for harsh environments.